Hey guys, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. I wanted to do a very exciting, exciting, exciting video on some products that I went on the hunt for and I finally found them. So of course I had to share with you guys. I want you guys first to excuse my lighting because it is very dark outside. It's probably like 10 o'clock in the morning right now and the sun you think would be shining, but I live in Miami and if you guys haven't been keeping up with the news, there's a hurricane out there, Hurricane Isaac, and um, we're getting like his bands and stuff like that we're supposed to be feeling him starting tomorrow into monday and i know you guys don't know this but i am petrified of hurricanes i'm so scared of hurricanes it's ridiculous so i'm about to leave now and go get some last minute preparations i already got a lot of things i need but i'm still like i need some more like canned stuff just in case because you never know so um I still wanted to film this uh, video for you guys. I wasn't going to let it stop me. And they are on the new limited edition Maybelline color tattoos. And I have a lot of the old ones. There's like 10 of the permanent collection of the Maybelline color tattoos. And I own about seven of them. So there's only three that I'm missing. And I love those things. And I'm going to be honest with you guys. I love them as bases because I don't really use them as an eyeshadow alone. The only one that I do use as an eyeshadow alone would be the bad to the bronze i love it by itself like it's fine by itself but i feel like a lot of the other ones especially the bright colors can be a tad bit blotchy so i use it as a base throw my eyeshadow over it and it's incredible like it lasts all day long and it just makes the color of my eyeshadows pop so of course, when I heard about the new colors and these bad babies that were coming out for fall, I had to get them. And of course, slap limited edition on anything and you go on the hunt for them. So these actually have a limited edition sticker on it. So this little um, plastic band that goes around it actually says limited edition in pink letters. And the weird thing about these is that some of them are found in Target and there's other ones that are found in Rite Aid and um, CVS, I heard. I do not have Rite Aid here in Miami and it felt like forever for these to get here. I learned about them about three weeks ago and um, I noticed a lot of people were on the hunt for them. So I finally decided on Thursday, today's Saturday, I've had them since Thursday, I finally decided to stop at my local Target and Target had the brightest colors of the bunch. They had four of them and they were the brightest four that they do have and I actually picked up two. I didn't pick up all four because I wanted to get colors that I don't have in my collection. So I got this blue color, beautiful. This one's called 100 Blue on Buy and I got this pinky fuchsia color, which is 300 fuchsia fever. The two that I did not get is a teal color and a green color. And the teal was dark and the green was, I don't even know how to describe the green, but I have edgy emerald and I have the teal one and I prefer the brighter ones. So I already own those from the regular collection. So I, de I decided not to get those. And they were about $6 in Target, about $6.50, I want to say around the $6.50 price. And I love these guys. These are awesome. I mean, the colors, I'm going to show you here, the swatches. This is the blue and this is the fuchsia. And that's only with one swatch. Like I went in and I swatched it. And just to show you guys, let me open it for you. This is the blue. I mean, can you imagine this as a base to a blue? I mean, your eyes are going to ridiculously pop. So I had to get this. I mean, I don't, I, I don't think I've even seen anything like that. Maybe MAC has them, but like I told you guys, I prefer these over MAC because they can dry out, first of all. I mean, none of my other ones have dried out. But I mean, these are in pop format, so they can dry out. And with MAC, they're like 15, between 15 to $20, and these are 6 bucks. And MAC always has limited edition. So, I mean, I'm sure MAC came out with a blue but I'm sure that I cannot go buy it right now. So, you know, and then I have to go on a hunt for it or wait till they come up with another collection. And this is the fuchsia pink one. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And I got so lucky at Target because I went like Thursday right after work. So maybe like around six ish. And they had like just put the collection up because nobody had even touched the color tattoos. So that was incredible. And then I heard that the other colors that I wanted to get were at Walgreens or Rite Aid, like I said, and I don't have Rite Aid. So I stopped at Walgreens on the way home. I stopped at one and they did not have it. So I was a little disappointed. So I stopped at another Walgreens on the way home and there was another four different colors and I picked up another two I did not get the other two because once again I wasn't um 
feeling those. There was, there was a mahogany color, like a really dark mahogany color. Not something that I would normally wear, so I wasn't going to buy it. And the other one was a new gold one. And I have the bold gold. And this one was like a different kind of gold. But to me, it was almost the same for me to be having them. So I didn't get the other one. I just got these two. And here I have... um 100 barely beige which kind of reminds me of the mac paint pot in uh, bear study and this one is 200 mossy green which is a beautiful beautiful green let me show you guys here i actually saw a video that emily noel 83 did that she used this as her base of course and then she used some maybelline um eyeshadow quad to do a look and it looked gorgeous so i can't wait to get that new maybelline eyeshadow quad that she had in her video i believe it was called a uh, spicy cinnamon so i want to grab that too but as you can see this is the mossy green and like i said i do have the edgy emerald but it's nothing like this that's like a bright green and this one is more of a you know dark green for fall so it will be perfect and then the barely beige is just your basic beige i have the two cool one from the regular collection but that is like a white white like a basic white and this one is a nice like pearly beige color so i'm gonna really like this one as a base as well and the, at walgreens actually i got them for buy one buy one get one half off there was a bogo deal but they're of course drugstore a little more expensive they were like close to like more eight dollars at um walgreens they were six no they were 749 so i got two of them my total was like 12 dollars. so i paid about 25 dollars or 24 25 dollars for all four of them and i'm really excited um if you guys are looking into these grab them because like each display actually the ones in walgreens only had like two or three each and the ones in um target they had like four or five each so i mean you have a greater opportunity of getting the um colorful ones so definitely stop at rite aid or cvs or walgreens i don't know if walgreens is gonna have them and pick these up guys because once they're gone i don't know if maybelline's gonna put them out again i don't know if they're gonna plan on making some permanent i don't know i don't know i don't know but i'm so happy i got my hands on all these bad boys once again there's eight total in the collection and i got four of them and i think i'm gonna stay with these four because i had the opportunity to grab all of them but i just didn't want them and these are the swatches i didn't forget for the two that i showed you that i got at Walgreens this is the mo the mossy green and that is the barely beige that's actually two swatches of the barely beige and one of the mossy green so those are the four colors there guys and I mean this blue re dick I mean, out of all of these colors, hands down, I was definitely going for the blue. That's why I stopped at Target first because I was on beauty broadcast and everybody was telling me the bright ones were only at Target. So of course, my first stop was at Target. I mean, that is incredible. I cannot wait to use it. And once again, depending on where you get it, Target is like six bucks to seven dollars and drug stores are from like seven to eight dollars. So once again, guys, if you do live around me or you live like in Florida, please be careful for Hurricane Isaac and stuff like that. I don't know how bad it's going to affect us. We're going to, you know, keep watching it and stuff like that. But supposedly it's supposed to be a category one by the time it reaches us. And I don't like hurricanes, so I'm going to make sure that I'm very prepared because they scare the bejesus out of me. Like I am such a baby when it comes to hurricanes hurricanes like I don't like to be without electricity and hearing all those winds and and being in that all that rain and all that flooding and I was around for Hurricane Andrew and that like traumatized me so that this kind of stuff is not for me so I'm definitely have to go get prepared but anyway thank you for watching this video guys let me know if you guys grabbed any link them down below I'm interested if anybody got all eight or if they just got a couple and what were the colors that they specifically picked thank you for watching guys stay safe and have a great weekend take care bye